So what is up guys? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Movement6 and before we start a huge, huge thank you to everybody who subbed this week. And if you're new here, just drop that like, drop that subscribe. You can just leave a comment, you know, or in the best mode is put those notifications on. You will not miss a thing. Sometimes a bit of gaming, some bit of music, techno, sometimes movies. But today, today, I, I'm advising you to stop, stop, just stop looking at those big YouTubers not being paid by Activision because the breaking news is right over here. It's right over here, guys. And <clears throat> this is something I've, I've been waiting for a long time. I'm still a small channel, but bringing this type of news from this channel, from, from this desk, is it's amazing this is why you create youtube channels guys and it's also something that no one saw coming absolutely no one the news is i'm 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 gonna tell you i'm not gonna bring you one breaking news i'm gonna give you a couple of items that will blow you away and will eventually make you run to the store to buy the new black ops call of duty cold war installment and I've been playing some Call of Duty this morning. In all fairness, the combined or allied assault or combined assault, this domination in that larger map, or I don't know how this map's called, you know, it was actually kind of fun. But in all fairness, Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War is nothing more than modern warfare with a new skin, and we all need to pay 70 euros for it, right? But today, <clears throat> I'm giving you a couple of reasons this is this is hot news why you are going to be hyped and now for sure now for real <clears throat> here it goes here it goes call of duty black ops cold war will feature new town i said it you go to cartel the map in the hangar you already find the pictures there if you saw it that's nuketown i shit you not something we've been waiting for a long time it's out of this world we're gonna have nuketown on top of that that's the bonus i'm gonna give you it's gonna feature summit and jungle and on top of that those are immediately the best maps of Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy shit. You know, there are YouTube channels out there that actually brought this as freaking breaking news. And we've already reached a status, a, a position, a point with Call of Duty that every other year we're hyped to see Nuketown back. Nuketown is in every Call of Duty from this developer. Summit and Jungle as well. And the reason is quite simple. Because Call of Duty is a copy-paste environment, guys. And I'm, I'm not saying that, you know, as, <laughs> let's face it, we're all going to buy it and we're all going to have some fun with it. But after three months, this game is dead in the water. I've I, when I saw this news, I fired up Black Ops 4 uh, and played some nuke down there. Uh, realized I hated Black Ops 4 and that whole Black Ops 3 and 4 is to me the same, but without the war running. But <clears throat> what are we doing here? It, it's actually someone I'm not going to name and shame. I'm a small YouTube channel, guys. Come on. But <clears throat> nuke town presented as oh we discovered an easter egg oh we discovered a hint to nuketown oh and then speculating our asses off about summit and jungle <clears throat> i can tell you summit is coming back jungle is coming back nuketown is in there for sure so what are we talking about is this actually news is this actually news for you guys i have jesus freaking christ I, in all fairness the beta we're now playing, and it ends today, I believe, is actually <clears throat> better than the alpha we've seen. It is. 
I, I will be the first one to admit it. it the way it plays, the way it feels, and and that 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 map. I'm so lousy in map names. The 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 map in the desert with those. That's actually a pretty decent map, right? It's pretty fun. And the combined assault type motors that are in there are actually kind of fun. It's it's by all means not bad. But is it worth 70 euros of your money? And, and I've been advocating this for a long time. Stop the annual release, take Modern Warfare, and every year gave it a great, a complete new skin. And heck, let people pay 15 euros for that every year. I don't give a shit. And and you, you're done. Give it to another developer. Just take that. Here's an, here is it. Go to another developer. He does his thing with it. And then it goes to another developer. And then, but now we have YouTube channels actually pushing that Nuketown is breaking news because it's going to be... In. It's not breaking news. Summit is also not breaking news. We know the modes. We know a couple of maps we've seen right now. On top of that, I gave you three more maps. We're going to have zombies and we're going to have a war zone. It's... Why, why, why are people so completely obsessed about this? I, I literally, I, I did, I left my balls off. I, I saw the title, "Breaking News," Newtown, bruh. <laughs> that's not that's not breaking news. That's for the clicks, the likes, and that's why I made this video for the clicks and the likes. So um, it's okay, guys. I just wanted to make some fun out of this. Um, bottom line. The beta is a bit better than the alpha. Um, still on the same hype level, which is pretty low. Uh, we're going to pay 70 euros for the exact same game you have right now. Um, with exact same maps we've seen in Black Ops 4, Summer Jungle and Nuketown. And you can add the other suspects as well. Um, and yeah, that's it. You know, And uh, we're going to pay 7 euros for the exact same game. See you guys soon. Back to the madness.